Hello, my name is Rahul. Today I am going to show you how to code an app to rotate image using Objective C and Cocoa framework. Demo. It will rotate. App will rotate this image full 360. Okay. I am going to use Xcode 7.1.1. Now create a new Xcode project, name it Rotate Image, next create, ok, now go to main storyboard, select view, drag in an object, ok now create a cocoa class to handle graphics of type ns object ok now name it gui handler ok next create ok now go to main storyboard map uh, this and a subject that we dragged GUI handler ok it mapped now create another cocoa class next name it image rotate ok make it ns view next create ok now go to main storage board select the view this one view and map it to uh, image rotate ok it mapped ok now select and uh, select this handler our new GUI handler object this one and ok switch to this view ok it will show the interface and implementation both now go to main storyboard now you have access to GUI handler interface now add a bracket over here ok now drag a reference of view it will create a reference underscore rotate image ok we can connect now over here select a slider horizontal slider over here make sure you ok put it over little now click here add missing constraints ok now run it test the slider resize ok we have a error we need to hash import that is your image rotate dot h ok now run it come build successfully now it's loading we need to close previous one ok it resize properly we need to set the values over here go over here your default value where it is totally forget it ok current value is 0 ok it goes to 0 it is under this properties attribute inspector this is identity inspector this is property inspector attribute inspector ok now now we need to 
drag <coughs> reference over here. It is a output outlet um, SL change angle. Okay, connect it. Now drag an action over here. This is your action. All output will go in bracket and action goes out side the back bracket now change angle make it connect okay now over here okay we have the angle over here change angle okay now we need to use this to code our uh, image rotation ok first we are going to going to do wide window view did move to window that will uh, will be used to initialize our variables ok over here ok at the rate public public is your angle that is your int we are going to use degree for our angles ok now make a ns image object img ok and a ns size to store image size img underscore size ok now over here make it pointer ok now we need to drag in a image to do that we are going to open this still image ok just drag and drop finish ok now over here img is equal to ns image mm, name image named ok at the right that is your still dot jpg ok now image size is equal to img size ok we are going to use this in our render image render now create a bitmap image ok now ns bitmap ok pointer bitmap ok is equal to ns bitmap allocation ok now bracket we are going to initialize initialize with bitmap planes ok now that's a huge ok that is null now this one is your mm, image not this one image underscore size dot width ok image size dot height ok per sample is 8 per pixel is samples per pixel is 4 has alpha yes is planar no 
now the color scheme's name is ns device that is your device rgb color space okay ns alpha alpha bitmap format okay bytes per row is 0 bytes per pixel is 0 okay make sure you define it properly okay now now we are going to use transform ns i transform that is your trans is equal to ns affin transform transform okay now trans that is your translate we are going to move origin from to top bottom left co corner to middle of the form okay over here your dirty rectangle dirty rectangle dot size dot width divide by 2 dirty this one copy paste here dot size dot height divide by 2 ok now trans rotate by degree not radian its degree ok that is your angle angle what type of angle it is we are sending it from the slider so it it is from 0 to 100 so we are going to use angle is equal to ok angle is equal to angle multiply by 3.6 okay now we have a error okay that is your pointer okay now angle is set now we are going to make a before that trans concat okay that will implement the transformation now we are going to create a graphics context ns graphic context pointer g is equal to ns graphic context that is your graphics with context bitmap this one okay that is your bitmap that you created this one let's copy it paste here okay now we are going to use this okay now we are going to do ns graphics ns graphics context save graphics state okay now ns graphic context set current context that is your g now you are using now we are using the bitmap to draw our uh, to render to draw our image on it okay now ing that we read over here okay now going to render over here draw in rectangle ns make rectangle ok that is your 0 0 width is ing size dot width ing size dot height ok after that we are going to release 
ns graphics context restore graphic state okay now we are going to render that bitmap okay bitmap draw in rectangle okay that is your ns make rectangle 0 0 that is your image size dot width image size dot height okay now copy both because we are at our origin paste here divide by 2 and the divide by 2 whole minus and this is minus okay now place your semicolon here okay now stop this run it okay we centered it and we are going to connect the rotation with this slider now the angle will be passed from the GUI handler from here we have the over here okay angle is equal to slider okay slider integer value okay now save it what is this nothing no problem it will work okay now run it let's see okay one more thing we rotate image set need display true it will cause the render re-render the ok ok One more thing, it is anti clockwise. Okay, to make it clockwise, we need to go over here. Okay, not full over here, make it negative. Stop it, run it. Okay. You can save that bitmap in a file. Okay. That way you can code your image rotation using Objective-C. Thank you.